Samburu National Game Reserve is home to a wide range of wildlife. It's a huge draw for tourists, but it also attracts less welcome visitors, poachers interested in elephant tusks and rhino horn. But Google Street View is now doing its bit to protect those animals. Tracking them with the help of Google Earth, we get to see their whole range and then we understand what elephants need to survive. And that's, that, that's powerful information if we're, if we're going to try and secure elephants of future in Africa. That's information that we need because we need to take that information to government planners and to community planners and county governments and say, this is where elephants roam. These are the corridors they use. These are the areas they feed in during different times of year. Kenya has emerged as a major transit route for ivory destined for Asian markets from Eastern and Central Africa. It is hoped that Google Street View will make surveillance of the country's wildlife more efficient. When the technology came up and we were able to get a GPS collar, then you know we didn't have a Google um, Google tracks or Google map tracks. <clears throat> and the challenge there was we had to go ourselves very close to the elephant. It doesn't matter where the elephant was, what situation the elephant is, you have to go to the elephant himself, uh, you know, very close to the elephant, try and download the information. And often, you know, these links break because, you know, this elephant is moving the whole time. Experts estimate Africa's elephant population has fallen by more than 60 percent over the past decade. More than 30,000 elephants are killed every year on the continent. Maria Galang, CCTV.